lived and died several lives that night <laughs> at Lucille. And Beater, it was great to see that. And for the players, of course, many still on the bench waiting for their opportunity. We'll see how that ends up playing out. Yeah, just how many times. There's a lot of little nuances to all of this. The Madre de Ciudades is one of the stadiums that Argentina wants to have the World Cup. Lining up today, let's start with whichever. Up today. Leandro Macuna was, was being interviewed a few days ago, actually yesterday to be more precise, by a, an Argentine journalist, and he have played in the Netherlands. Eloy Rom, for example, played for a Messi with the ball down the right side. Messi, if he gets past the defender, it could be 1 0. And it, oh, Leandro Martinez started cheering. And unbelievably missed a wide open portions by Lautaro Martinez. Now trying to dig in a little bit more. Pretty well so far. Watch out over on the far side of the ball that goes through. Messi. Good pass to Nico Gonzalez laying it off for Leo Messi. Hello, room. David to parry that ball wide. After it will be Lo Celso. Watch out with Enzo Fernandez finding Messi a little bit too far. But there's one. And that shot missing wide. And it's Montiel, has Lautaro Martinez dropping out to Messi! And a run! And a run once more! Argentina getting closer this time around. Messi, getting past two defenders, Leo with the left foot, looking to open things up. Down. Laying it off, Gonzalez! Ball again, one. Trying to slot it through, Messi! Coach back in, Messi! Gonzalez, Lautaro Martinez, Nico, Rome with another sensational save. Well, he's got exploited in the spaces that you do leave. Pick your point. The header off the line. Goal! Goal! Lautaro Martinez going in the direction. Also the one that ends up. Messi sends it to Nico Gonzalez again. A square ball back inside. All alone for Messi. Can he get two? Messi ends up from going out of bounds. Nico Gonzalez, watch out over on the far side. A chance to shot that just ends up being Messi still going through. Messi dribbling around. Lautaro Martinez. Messi. Lautaro Martinez lays it off for Leo. Leo again. If he finds. Another space. Laying it up for Leo Messi. Again, cutting back towards the middle. Messi has that ball poked away. Nico. Messi. Oh. 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 Goal! Oh. Leo Messi. Times two. Argentina three. Curacao nil. 100 becomes 101 very quickly and he wouldn't bet on that ending there Lionel Messi this time on killing off that match against Mexico Dibu Leo has to step back Enzo Fernandez Golazo Goal Enzo Fernandez 4-0 for Argentina. Lautaro Martinez looking for his goal. Lautaro. Finally it goes through. Messi looking for a hat trick. Leo, Leo, Messi, 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 goal. Goal. Leo Messi times three. He's got the hat trick. Will you want more? I don't know. But right now, it's 5-0 Argentina. 
And it's the 50th hat-trick of Lionel Messi's remarkable career. Lo Celso and Messi linking up again here to great effect. I talked about the relationship between those two players. We were robbed of seeing at the World Digging in, looking for some open space. McAllister. Argentina's midfield have been put in. The more dangerous he becomes. And then when you've talked about Argentina time and time again. Off within a couple of minutes with Lautaro making the mistake of giving Lionel Messi almost on. Then again, that's just the player that we're dealing with right now. It'll be Messi. Messi! Oh. McAllister, McAllister with some room, leaving it for Nico Gonzalez! Una, he's just waiting. The Lautaro Martinez, if he cuts inside, it could be six. Lautaro! Rom. Once again, slamming the door, waiting for the ball. Also, Lo Celso getting into the area. Lautaro! Eloy Rom once again. That's what, seven saves for the door. Here's a chance for Messi. Does he get there first? No! Being honored amongst many that were Chiqui Tapia, the president of the Argentine FA, tied for the all time. Lo Celso reminding the supporters and built a great spirit. It's still question, but with every match that followed, they weren't playing great football, which ends up being a positive. Great ball by Messi. Here's another chance. Seloy Rum. That's number seven for as he floats a little bit. Watch him floating over, trying to find that ball. The header! This time it was Nico Gonzalez. Or excuse me, it was Dybala. Comfortable, then maybe there's no place. There's under Severina playing for Ado Denag in the Netherlands. Messi. <laughs> there was a an entanglement. The referee wants to be as diplomatic as possible. Pushing that ball through. Dybala wanting to force it. Dybala turning options. Looking to run through Messi. Back out wide. Stays a little bit short for... Knocking it back and forth in very reduced space. Looking for Di Maria. Has a man open in Rodrigo de Paul. Ends up going out of bounds. Angel. Angel has room. Right there. Di Maria. But he'd be amongst those that have to be considered Messi looking for number four. Great save by Rome. Listen to that response for Dibu Martinez. Yes, One of the biggest characters in our team. more like 10 meters. Messi. Messi looking for number four. Messi cutting back inside. Messi. Rome. Rome once more. Yeah. Here's another chance to make it seven. Again, the ball goes through. Oh. Gonzalo Montiel makes it seven. And yes, on this one, he had nothing that he could do. And he still tried. Seven nil. Still tried to claw that one back from the goal. Out of the area, seeing if he can get a chance. Messi. Messi trying to take it to the line, and it'll end up being a... Nil. Messi. Trying to po toe poke it his toe poke it through. And whatever other areas you want to talk about is a good ball going through. This could be the chance, trying to heel flick it over. And that's where, let's see who Messi gives the uh, perfect choice. Qatar Bishop Cup is 36 years old and has played with Lionel Messi. Before the first time, 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 the এই শতাব্দীতে বিশ্বকাপে আর্জেন্টিনাকে সবচেয়ে বেশি বার কাঁদিয়েছে কোন দল সবাই বলবে জার্মানি 2006 2010 2014 টানা তিন বিশ্বকাপে আর্জেন্টিনাকে শোকের সাগরে ভাসিয়েছে জার্মানি এবার ইন্দোনেশিয়ায় অনুষ্ঠিত ফিফা অনুর্ধ্ব 17 বিশ্বকাপের সেমিফাইনালে মানে ছোটদের বিশ্বকাপেও আর্জেন্টাইনদের বড় যন্ত্রণা দিল জার্মানরা হেরে চোখের জলে আসর থেকে বিদায় নিয়েছে আলবিসেলেস্তেরা এ নিয়ে ষষ্ঠবারের মতো অনর্ধ্ব 17 বিশ্বকাপের সেমি থেকে বিদায় নিল আর্জেন্টিনা নির্ধারিত 90 মিনিট ও যোগ করা সময়ে রোমাঞ্চকর লড়াইটা তিন তিন সমতায় শেষ হয় 
ম্যাচের পুরো সময় জুড়ে হয়েছে হাড্ডাহাড্ডি লড়াই জাভার মানাহান স্টেডিয়ামে টাই ব্রেকারে আর্জেন্টিনাকে চার দুই ব্যবধানে হারিয়ে অনূর্ধ সতের বিশ্বকাপের ফাইনালে পৌঁছে যায় জার্মানি ফিফার নিয়ম অনুযায়ী বয়সভিত্তিক এই বিশ্বকাপের নক আউট পর্বের ম্যাচে অতিরিক্ত সময় না থাকায় সরাসরি খেলা গড়ায় পেনাল্টি শুট আউটে সেখানে পাঁচ শটের চারটিতে গোল করেন জার্মান যুবারা জার্মানির হয়ে জোড়া গোল করেন প্যারিস ব্রুনার ও একটি গোল করেন ম্যাক্স মোরস্টেড আর আর্জেন্টিনার হয়ে তিনটি গোলই করেন অগাস্টিন রোবার্তো আর্জেন্টাইনদের নেওয়া চার শটের প্রথম দুটি রুখে দেন জার্মান গোলরক্ষক কনস্টানটাইন হেই